Oh gosh. Gosh, a nice one. He's got me around it. Oh, what? I'm out fishing in a new place today, um, trying to catch some sheep's head on some docks. I've just gotten started fishing, fished around a little bit. I've had a couple bites, felt like smaller ones. This area looks good on a map. That's all I really know. I don't have any history. I've never heard of anybody fishing for them in this area. I'm sure people do, but gonna continue along to an area that looks a little bit better than what I've been fishing. I do think I probably could have caught some where I was fishing. I saw one small one chewing on a piling, but nothing too spectacular and my window for what i want to be fishing i don't want to use up that time fishing in a not so great area so if you'll bear with me i'm going to keep exploring and hopefully stumble upon some fish Big fish, crap. Where'd I get? Redfish? It's gotta be a redfish. took a while that took a while but that's a good one. Oh man I think I've fished for an hour now but that one's over five pounds so I can live with that maybe not over five but I would give him a respectable five pounds knew they were here. Place looks too inviting. I'm gonna try to get a quick measurement. Let's see what we got here. Hopefully I don't lose them. I'm planning to keep this one. is a little over 20 inches great fish great fish kind of skinny oh man on the board on the board now time for me to bleed him and get him in my cooler just gonna get in here and cut his gills ice out, let him bleed a little bit. Let's try not to lose him here. Okay. That fish was on a larger crab and with all the trash fish around right now, it makes sense why I got him on that. I'd like to get about three that size today. I'm hoping there's a group of them here. Time will tell.
Definitely some structure down there. Makes sense why he was there. There's a good bite. I don't know if it's the right species. Feels like a toadfish. He took me into a rock. Some sort of bite. Mm, I don't think that was the right bite. Good cast. Let's try out here. That's a nice one. He's got me around it. That is not good. That is not good. We'll just see if he comes around. Nope, came off. Dang it, that was a big one. Shredded me up. Dang it. That is the game I'm playing. Sometimes the sheep's head win. That's another nice fish. Bummer. You can see where he shredded my fluorocarbon. I didn't have much of an option there. As soon as he ate, he swam right around the post. We'll try again. See if we can get one this time. See a decent one. Eh, I don't know that he's that nice. He's on the post where I caught the last one. There's no way this is going to work, but I'm going to try. Just dropping it on his head. Oh, it might have worked. I think he grabbed it. Yeah, he grabbed it and he's swimming with it now. Broke me off. Had me around the other post. Dang it. That fish is bigger than the one I saw. Hmm. Can't win. Okay, got another 30 pound fluoro leader on here, which is pretty dang heavy, but apparently not heavy enough. But I can't use heavier because it won't bite. Might have just seen one right there. Dang. Nice fish. Not as nice. Oh, what? A tog in August? A nice tog in August? Yeah, I knew there was some structure down there. I didn't know there was that much. <laughs> wow. 
That's a nice fish. What the heck? Getting highly exotic. Dang right. That's a nice fish. <laughs> That is just too cool. I did not think I was going to catch that fish today. Which is why it pays to do some exploring. Let's see how long this fish is. Because I feel like he's pretty nice. A dang big one for North Carolina inshore in August. Yeah. He's almost 16 inches. Going to bleed this fish. Okay, 15 and a half inch tog off of a dock in August in the south. Pretty neat. All right, rigged up again. fish. Missed him. Must be a big school of fish here. I may not have to move. Yep, something's swimming with it. Feeling like a sheep's head probably. Oh, pulled off. That sucks. Get another good fish. Bummer, bummer, bummer. Big fish. Not a great one, but certainly not a bad one. I think I'll let that fish go. He's probably 17 inches, would be my guess. A nice one for sure, big enough to keep. our success. That's a 
great fish. Got him. That's another good one. That will be the other one that I keep, and if I get one more this size, I'll probably keep that as well. He is a little smaller than the first one, right at 19. 19 incher. Probably a four pounder. His gills cut. Another good bite, I think. No. There we go. Small fish. Sea bass, maybe? Nope. Baby sheep's head. Little guy. Good. has to have some. There we go. Getting a bite of some sort. Not the right bite. Another sea bass? Big sea bass living here. Wow. Oh, that is a nice fish. Okay, I knew there had to be one here. Let's see if I get him. If that's the fish I saw or not. Oh, and he came off. It wasn't a bad one. I don't know if that's the fish that I saw. It may have been. It's a decent one. Not as big as his others, but a decent fish for sure. See if there's any more here. under here. Let's see if there's maybe a decent one with them. There was. Mm -mm. Oh man, 
I'm really losing them. They're biting funny. Biting funny. Brand new jig. Dang it. Wow. Incredible that fish came out. Wow, he swam me all up in that dock. Somehow, I got him out. Not a big one at all. Had it been a big one, I would have definitely lost him. Probably 14 inches. Fighting hard in this clear water. Yeah. Got it. All right. Whew. Long overdue. Took me a while to get this one. I'm probably gonna let this one go. He's a little big to keep for what I'm looking for. I don't know, I'll measure him and see. I guess he's not that big, I'm just excited. Man, he bit so soft too. sucker is he is oh yeah he just has the first one 20 incher thought he was bigger that's a perfect one to keep all right gonna get him bled going duck hunting out west this winter and i need to save up some fish to barter with farmers that's what that's what these fish today are going towards. They're going to some farmer in South Dakota, most likely. Let's see if I can keep everything in the kayak here. Once that fish dies, I'm gonna clean, or not clean, 
empty that bag out. Ooh, he made a mess. He made a mess. Back to it for a little bit. him on. We will see if he stays on. There we go. Another one. Pretty fish here. Probably 18 inches. A soft bite on that one too. That's a pretty fish. Thank <laughs> you. 
That's a nice one. That's a great big one, actually. <laughs> There's like Spanish blowing up around me. That's a big fish. Dang right. Hell yeah. Biggest of the day there. Whew. I got a lot going on right now. Big one. Oh! Oh, I don't. There's so much happening right now. Mm. I want to get a measurement on this fish before I put him back. I need to get my jig out of the net. There's some big Spanish eating mullet right now. Heck yeah. That's a big one. 20, a little over 23. All right, buddy. There you go. That was a nice bite there. Should be the guy we're looking for. Oh gosh. Big fish. Real big fish. Wow. What do we have? Big sheep's head. Oh, I mean, a nice one. Not quite done, not quite done. Get in the net. Oh man. Ugh. How about that? I think this one probably would weigh more than the last fish. I don't know if he's as long. Man, that's another big one. Please don't 
freak out fish. Okay, check real quick. He's almost 22. Let's get this one back. Well, that's gonna be it. Had some really good sheepshead fishing. Um, it was slow but steady, and the quality of fish was very, very good for what I had anticipated catching, so I'm pretty stoked on that. But hope you enjoyed the video. Got all my equipment linked down in the description if you wanna check that out. We fish a lot of docks. Uh, um, yeah, that's good. Stuff. The bridges are good. I mean, yeah, there's they're everywhere. People just don't really fish for them. No, they don't. We catch any drum on those crab? Yeah, yeah. Redfish will eat them. Mm -hmm. Um, I haven't caught before the storm. We were catching them. Yeah. And I haven't caught them since. I'm sure they're still around, but I don't know what changed. But 
We're yeah. still catching the sheep's head and black drum, mm -hmm. but we're not really catching the redfish like we were before the storm. Yeah, they kind of moved on. They'll be they they'll be mixed in usually with the sheep's head and black drum on the docks, but. Yeah.